Hello, my name is Gabriel from Gabak USA. In this video, we are going to talk about how to become a computer technician. So if, you, if this is your first video that you are watching, I recommend to watch the prior video so that way you can see the other video because this is going to be a long list of many videos about how to become a, a computer technician. So this is one of the, the first one that you're going to see. So now we are going to talk about honesty and integrity it's not the same thing maybe it's something similar maybe you don't know but this is a very basic thing that you should know so honesty means to tell the truth and integrity means to do the right thing so how does it apply to you if this is very easy i'm going to tell you a very short example so if you are working for someone else let's say that you're working for a company and then your boss is calling you and you're jumping i mean you're driving you know from customer to customer or something like that and your boss is, is asking you hey where are you and you say well i'm driving uh, to x a customer and the true and that is not the true maybe are you're taking a nap you're eating you're doing something else so and you're maybe uh, stretching the truth a little bit so that is what it means and that is how uh, people act sometimes so that is what you should not do i mean you sh if you're saying okay i'm taking a nap say taking a nap and then take responsibility about that so uh, and when you are uh, with a customer and there are many things that are involved so maybe you're thinking well uh, this customer uh, has some problem with the virus with the computer or something like that and then you will say okay this is what we have to do we have to repair the the computer um, there are certain things that we need to do in order to fix the the computer and you may say okay you have a lot of things on your hard drive we are going to need a hard drive so it, because we have to save let's say five gigs and you say okay yeah but we are going to need eight terabyte hard drive um, maybe your stars Sell, uh, selling uh, things that the customer indeed doesn't need maybe with 500 uh, gigabytes hard drive will be more than enough for the customer but maybe because you have a cut in the sale and then things are getting ugly and the customer may not or may not know it so it's better always to say the truth and only the truth and nothing more than the truth so that is uh, one thing that you have to keep in mind when you even if you are getting some benefits some cut from the sale or anything like that so i recommend no not uh, to oversell so just sell what you need to sell and that's it i mean because people if you are saying okay yes oh, for doing this kind of task maybe you need uh, three monitors a huge computer i'm saying you know very powerful computer um, 20 gigs of ram and a super hard drive and a core i7 and all the things and maybe the guy just is using the computer to check the email and uh, to write a few texts and, and that's it and you are selling him more than he needs and when maybe this guy this customer is start talking with some friend or someone who knows more about computer than this guy itself i mean he, uh, he he will say oh but the cast the other technician he told me that i need this and this and this um things are going to get ugly so in order to avoid all those kind of problems so i recommend to say the truth and that's it but always if you are behaving well and you are doing good a good job and you're saying what the customer needs you always can get some referrals good testimonials you can maybe record the customer if he is happy and you can grab and you can get more more customers so that, that is the the idea and another thing that you have to keep in mind is when you fit, when you sit in front of the computer you have a lot of power people may not may know it may not know it but you will know it when you you are in front of the computer you have access to all his information and everything so if that is the case i mean remember that uh, the privacy and all the things 
except if you're looking, I mean, you're seeing something that is maybe illegal or maybe something that someone else might get hurt because something that you just saw and then you may, you may do something about it. I mean, maybe you talk with the police or whatever, but remember, uh, try not to ask for any password. If the customer tell you, okay, yeah, can you enter in this uh, computer? Okay, don't say, okay, give me the password. No, no, no. Just tell, let the, the customer type the password. And if you see something um, that is, is, no, is not very good or something like that, but it's not illegal or something like that, just forget, don't ask, and, and like that. I mean, uh, and you have to do just your job. I mean, don't do anything more, more than that because, I mean, I, I have seen this in another cost and another technicians or another customer or customer that uh, told me yes a, a customer i mean a technician came here and uh, she and this guy was talking with my secretary uh, and this guy started asking her to go out or maybe uh, this this guy another in another occasion also i heard yes the, this guy uh, add himself in the Facebook of this customer or something like that and you know all those things that some people may do or may not know so that is why you you have to do the right thing and tell the truth don't oversell the customer with more things that they they really need and um, don't try to start watching the pictures or don't don't do things that are, are no good like i, I said uh, before so that is a big mistake that many technicians uh, they make and things may get ugly so in order to be professional just do your job don't open more than software that the software that you just need to check i mean if the customer is next to you and you will say you want to ask him hey can we open this uh, software by software all the software so we can make sure that the computer after you clean it up uh, after you clean it uh, uh, everything works great i mean if he says yes and he's next to you no problem but don't start using their facebook or checking their email or seeing their pictures and all those things because there that is no 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 very good so that is my recommendation for a technician so if you want to know more about that or if you want to buy the the whole class about how to become a computer technician you can follow the links on the description or you can ask me on the in the comments also there is exams and notes and everything else so see you in the next class remember click like if you like it and dislike if you dislike it subscribe to my channel if you want to see more about how to become a computer technician and see you in the next class. Bye.